Hello everyone, Jason Warren for DTMet, and today we have a major system impacting portions of the upper Midwest and northern plains with blizzard conditions across portions of the Dakotas and into Minnesota. Blizzard warnings are in effect from Montana east across the entire state of North Dakota and into portions of northwestern Minnesota. The system over the northern plains is forecast to move to the southeast during the next 24 hours, spreading snow across portions of the Great Lakes and into the Ohio Valley. Some snow is also forecast to break out across the higher terrain of the Appalachians as some moisture begins to gather across that region. This afternoon and this evening there could also be some severe weather across portions of the lower Mississippi Valley with large hail damaging winds and a couple of isolated tornadoes possible. SPC's severe weather outlook for this afternoon and this evening does have a slight risk for severe storms across portions of eastern Oklahoma, southeastward into Arkansas, and far northwestern Mississippi. Again, damaging winds, very large hail, and an isolated tornado or two will be possible across this region. During the day on Sunday and into Sunday night, a weak area of surface low pressure will move up the eastern side of the Appalachians, while a very strong upper level low dives southeastward through the western Great Lakes. The combination of these two systems could produce an area of very intense snow squalls across portions of the Great Lakes and Upper Ohio Valley during Sunday and Sunday evening. Severe weather will be a threat again on Sunday, especially across the southeastern United States, with damaging winds, large hail, and isolated tornadoes possible. The moist onshore flow will continue out west through Sunday, with more heavy rainfall and high mountain snows from central California northward through the Pacific Northwest, and even spilling over into portions of the northern Rockies. By early next week, our focus will be on the east coast, where a major weather system is forecast to develop and could bring very intense snowfall to portions of the northeast during the middle of next week. By 7 a.m. Monday morning, the system is forecast to be centered just offshore of Cape Hatteras and moving northeastward. The system is forecast to intensify rapidly as it moves northeastward to a position near Cape Cod by Tuesday evening. Heavy snow is expected to fall north and west of the storm track across much of New England up into portions of Maine with strong winds helping to blow the snow around creating near blizzard conditions. The track of the system remains uncertain and a more inland track is still possible as well as a track that's slightly more offshore. And this has big implications for some of the bigger cities such as New York and Boston, which will be near the rain snow line. A track more toward the east would mean more snow, while a track further west would mean more rain. Either way, models are consistent in showing that the system will become very intense as it approaches the New England coast. They're also consistent in showing that the system will slow down significantly and possibly even stall as it approaches the Cape Cod area. Here's our current impact map showing a significant area of snow across much of New England, with areas from New York to Boston still highly questionable. Variations in the storm track will have a big impact on whether you see rain and snow or mostly snow, and of course that would have a big impact on the snow totals. So be sure to stay tuned, we'll provide additional updates as new information becomes available.